In this video, I'm going to show you how to paste formatted text into InDesign from Word so you can retain the bold, italic, and other formats in Word. I have InDesign open here right now, and as you can see, I'm all ready to go to paste my text. I will open my Word document here, and you'll see I've got a paragraph that I need to put into InDesign. So I will simply select this paragraph, and then go to edit and copy. And then I will go into InDesign and I will simply do edit paste. Now I will scale this up so you can see it. And this is the problem you're probably having. All of the italics and everything are removed from the doc, Sonata for Saxophone, Sonata for Saxophone, so you can see it doesn't have the italics. Here's the trick on how to get the italics, the bolds, the underline, and all that good stuff into InDesign from Word. In InDesign, what you do is you go to the InDesign menu or you go to Edit and Preferences, and you go all the way down from Preferences into Clipboard Handling. From Clipboard Handling, you'll see a couple of different options, and the bottom grouping is the one you want to change. You want to go when pasting text and tables from other applications, paste. Currently it's at text only, which it just did. Instead, you want all information, masters, swatches, styles, and all that. You click this button here, you hit OK, and now we will go into Word, we will recopy our text, we will go into InDesign, we'll scale this down a bit, and we'll simply go to Edit paste and now when I scale this up you will see that sonata for saxophone is italicized and the word maximum is italicized just like it's supposed to be also you can see this uh, 144 yeah everything looks great so that is how you paste formatted text into InDesign from Word so you can retain the bolds, the italics, and all the other formatting marks so you can save yourself a huge amount of time when you're importing text from Word or any other program into InDesign. Thank you very much for watching. Check out the link below to my class on InDesign layout for fiction books and also InDesign layout for nonfiction books where I have all these details and a lot more so you can get a lot more value and become better at InDesign. My name is Aaron Linsdow. I'm a professional InDesign user and oddly enough, a Polar Explorer. Check out more links below to me. Please like and comment on the video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much for watching and enjoy your InDesign.